Hey, what's going on guys? Okay, so today we're gonna to go over a microphone that was sent to me. This is the Monono WM760, or correctly, WM760 series. So I'm sure there's other ones, but this one is, is a dual microphone, well, two microphones with a receiver. And we're gonna open box it right now, or unbox it, and then we'll test it out and see how it is. All right, so let's go ahead and open it up and see what they sent me. Now, of course, I didn't pay for this, so this is a BA sponsored video. Uh, every once in a while, people reach out to me and send me stuff, and it's pretty nice. I'm not a singer, but it's nice to have a set of microphones. Anyways, let's open it up. So, what we get inside is, we have accessories, a little accessory box. It's pretty nice. They kept it separate. All right, what's in the accessory box? I have a, an adapter. All right. And I have, they look like uh, microphone, I guess, holders or stands. There's two of them. That's everything for the accessories. Two microphone stands. One little manual, all right. The receiver, okay. Easy. Microphone number one. Microphone number two. That's everything. Cool. The microphone has a nice feel to it. I know it's all metal, which is good because, you know, plastic, eh, you know, we really would want metal. Uh, there is one power button and two buttons for volume. All right, guys, let's get into it and get a little closer and let's plug it in. And let's test it out and see how the WM760 file performs. All right, let's plug it in. All right, guys, all right, so I have it hooked up now. It's hooked up to my small little amplifier, as you can see. Uh, this is a small amplifier, so I don't get a lot of power out of it. I just have it for my TV. But it does have the adapter, so you can plug it into a cell phone or a computer as well if you wanted to. Uh, I read the manual, and I'll start. There we go. So now, um, running through the microphone, I'm not sure if you can pick it up with the lav mic, but it sounds pretty good, I gotta say. So it's pretty straightforward. All you gotta do is hold the button down for about three to five seconds. It turns on right away. Uh, the channels, there are 20 channels. And let's see here, let's hold it down. Uh, one, two, three, and it's on, okay? It's automatic. It's gonna look for the, I guess, the channel that doesn't have interference, and then it just goes straight to it. It has a volume control on the actual microphone to push up. As you see, it gets a little louder. It has very, it's very clear. Uh, it has a very nice sound to it, I have to say. I do like it. This is a cardioid type microphone, so it's gonna block out sounds from the side. So if I talk to the side, it won't work. You have to talk right in the center, which is what you want, because if you have some other outside noises around you, you don't want it leaking in through the side. It works perfectly. They're right next to each other. There's no interference. So as I said before, it's 20 channels. They're all UHF, and it does it automatically. There's a plug and play. There's nothing to it. It's just put it into your, to your receiver or whatever it is that you're gonna output and it does the rest. Very nice. WM760, very nice. It takes six AA batteries. So you're gonna have two in here, two in here, and two in the receiver. So keep that in mind. Uh, it does have, give you a battery indicator on here as well, so you know if, how low it is. I don't know how accurate it would be, but I use rechargeable batteries, so if I was gonna use something, I'd pull it off the charger right away so it's brand new. Well, well, freshly charged, I would say. Uh, these little, I guess, uh, adapt, not adapters, but holders seem really strange to me. I looked at the manual, but I couldn't see anything that gave me any reason for them being orange. 
I mean, yeah, you can spot them right away, maybe. I mean, you can put them down and it works. Kind of an odd color, in my opinion. I would have gone with black because if you're, it's just a preference. I would have gone with black. I wouldn't have gone with this high, bright orange. Uh, other than that, it's a very nice little system. It's got some weight to it. This is all metal, which, is, which I'm glad, it's not plastic. So for you uh, karaoke, karaoke people out there, it has a good sound. I have a small amplifier, so I can't get a lot of power out of mine. As you can see uh, in the picture, it's not that big of a big amplifier. But uh, let's say I'm going to walk away. Uh, you know what? Let's go ahead and put, I'm going to leave the lav mic right next to the speaker. I'm going to walk away because it says it has a range of about 260 feet, more or less. Okay, so now I have the lav mic next to the speaker. I'm going to walk over here. So this gives me, I would say about uh, maybe 12 feet away, more or less. I'm going to walk over to the other side. So the house itself is, I believe, 30 feet in total wide. So I'm over here at 30 feet away. I'm going to go outside, I'm going to close the door, and we'll test it to see if there's any interference based on the fact that I have a wall between us and the receiver, which is right next to the lav mic. All right, let's go outside. See what the weather is like outside. It is hot, yeah. All right, so I'm closing the door. Now I can't hear anything because I'm outside, but it gives you an idea of whether or not there is a good sound, even with a wall between us and the receiver. The receiver is not that big, uh, so uh, I will see how it sounds. I'm pretty, pretty confident it will work pretty well. This is an interesting test. Uh, not, not, <laughs> not really that scientific, but it works. Anyways, guys, this was kind of neat. Uh, I never use a microphone like this way. I have a lav mic generally, and it's over there next to the speaker, so that's what you hear me through. You hear me through this to the actual lav mic, and... Uh, that's it. All right, guys. Thanks for coming by. I appreciate it. First time here. Thank you for stopping in. Third, fourth, fifth time here. Thanks for coming back. I've been really busy these days, so I haven't made as many videos as I usually make, but I'm getting back in track again. Okay, guys. Have a great day, and i catch you in the next one. See ya.